there, Ospreys and Jags fans. I'm Mike Brandy. Welcome to Just Jags, where we discuss all things Jacksonville Jaguars. It's time to regroup and move forward as the Jaguars are coming off a 23-17 loss to the Indianapolis Colts. The play of this young team continues to improve as the defense kept opposing quarterback Carson Wentz below 200 yards passing. A matter of fact, the last two games the Jags defense has allowed 14.5 points per game. A man who can speak on the play of the defense is Jags defensive tackle Malcolm Brown. Let's hear what he had to say. We know all the talent that's in the room. We know what we could do, man. It's just about, like I said, mistakes here and there. We, we, we hurting ourselves, us doing this and that. You know what I mean? Lately, we've been hitting on all those keys, not making mistakes, been having communications, and all the good things the defense need to have. And we've been playing like it, you know what I mean? So we just need to continue to improve on those things and get better at the things that we're not good at. This week, the Jags are looking for a San Francisco treat as the 49ers come to town. And they looked good after convincingly being the LA Rams 31 to 10 on Monday Night Football. Here is Jaguars head coach Urban Meyer on San Fran's coach Kyle Shanahan and the 49ers offense. They don't, uh, they don't hold the ball on offense, and they run the ball and have very good play action off it. A lot of eye candy where they're moving things around and checking you to make sure you're secure. The other thing, they picked two plays, like you saw that toss play, and they went, but they ran it 15 times, maybe 20 times in that game. So they find something, and obviously I met with our defense. That's what they do. They find something to keep going and going. Well, that's all I got for you for this edition of Just Jags. I'm Mike Brandy, and I'll catch you down the line.